Puebla. What is good YouTube, you're kicking it with Afro Boy here. And before we get into this video, be sure to smash that like button. And if you're new, smash that subscribe button. Also, be sure to go check out the Team Nimbus channel. Video just went up. Intro vid. We finna get it started. All right. Now, a couple of hours ago, uh, Pokemon Go has released an update. Now, this is update 1.1.0. All right. So, there's like some... <clears throat> Well, I don't know my voice is this horse right there. There was some major, um, one major thing that happened in the update. I'm gonna go down the list of them, all right? Number one, trainers, our avatars can now be recustomized from the profile screen. So, you know the profile screen. You click on the profile, now it's over to the bottom right. You press that, and it's gonna show the journal, and also gonna show character recustomization. You get to customize your character over. All right, so that's another, you know, that's something a little major, and say finally get to change. Yeah, personally it looks like I don't think that will matter though because like nobody else can see him but hey if you want to change the name, yeah go ahead but the second thing is they adjusted some Pokemon battle move damage values so I guess they adjusted some values um they refined certain gym animations they improved memory issues um, adjusted battle battle damage calculation and various bugs during wild Pokemon encounters I know that was a big one Every time you encounter a uh, wild Pokemon, either it would freeze. Um, sometimes it would just say error, and then you can't catch the Pokemon. It runs away, and then you keep throwing the ball at the Pokemon, and it kept jumping out. It won't, it won't catch, and then like, then that's when the error thing pops up. You know what I'm saying? Um, they updated Pokemon um, details, UI, updated achievement metal art, so it looks, the metal art looks, some of the metal art looks different, actually a cool thing, you know, they, some of it looks different. They fixed the issue with displaying certain map features and minor text fixes, so the text looks a slightly, looks actually a lot different, they like bolded the, um, the CP value of the Pokemon, if you look at it, um, your Pokemon, it, you can see that they bolded the CP, CP value. But the biggest thing about this update is they remove footprints on nearby Pokemon. So as you know, there's been a bug, it was a glitch going around where all the Pokemon said three steps away. It was like, I don't know, when they updated it, it like messed it up. They did something with the server, so it like messed up the Pokemon um, tracker. But now they say, you know what, we're not even going to fix it. We're just going to get rid of it completely. So now it shows nothing. It just shows the Pokemon. So. It, I don't know if it makes it harder to find Pokemon. I'm gonna go check it out tomorrow to see, but it's just weird now because the Pokemon is just there. I don't know why they didn't do it like how they did it. And if you look at the go look at the Pokemon go trailer, you would see that when you're looking for Pokemon, it would tell you how many meters away it was. I don't know why they just didn't go with that. That's what they should have did. It would have been smarter instead of these three steps, two steps, one step. But they say, you know what, this is get rid of completely. So hopefully. They come out with another update bringing the actual meters and how far away it is because I think that's better than the three footsteps was. And I think since they got rid of the um, footprints, they reduced the size, like the radius where your um, where your trainer tracks Pokemon, like the radius. They decreased it from 31,000 to like 15,000. So now it's like a shorter radius. So I guess that would kind of help you out with find the Pokemon because they won't be as far as away. Instead of 100 meters, it's 70 meters now. So yeah, so that's basically it. I mean, just like I said, my thing is they should have just added the meters. That's the big thing. They should add the meters. But other than that, some of the stuff, I'm still looking for the battling and the trading. I don't know. They, they need to work on that and get that out because... um. I don't know, man. You know, I'm still out here trying to find these Pokemon. I'm trying to get this Dragon Knight. Just got a Dratini, but yeah. So they, they need to go ahead and release the trading and the battling, and also they need to add the meters to the instead of the footprints for the Pokemon, because that's a lot easier than the three steps thing. But let me know what you think in the comment. Be sure to like this video and also be sure to subscribe to my channel. Also, go over and check the Team Nimbus channel. Be sure to go check that out. You already know who it was. It's the one and only Afro Boy, and I'm out. Peace.